Here are some people who encountered death and lived to tell the tale. Yulianne Kupke. Yulianne was flying over the Peruvian rainforest when lightning struck the plane. The plane cracked open in midair and Yulianne found herself outside of the plains during the roughly two mile drop and awoke the next morning on the forest floor with a broken collarbone and gashes on her arms and legs. Thanks to the survival skills she learned from living in a research station with her parents 30 miles away from the crash site, Yulianne knew that following a creek would be safer than walking on land. Eleven days later, she was found and rescued by lumber workers. Matthew Croucher Croucher, a Royal Marine, was on a mission in Afghanistan when he accidentally activated a tripwire booby trap that released a grenade. In an effort to save his comrades, Matthew threw himself on top of the grenade using his body armor and backpack. When the grenade exploded, he was thrown into the air and suffered only a mere nosebleed, along with temporary deafness. Alexis Goggins Alexis was seven years old when she and her mother were attacked by the mother's ex-boyfriend while in a vehicle. He was armed with a handgun and began shooting the mother. It is reported that Alexis jumped between her mother and the ex-boyfriend right as he was about to shoot the gun. The ex-boyfriend kept shooting without hesitation and Alexis suffered gunshot wounds to the eye, chest and other parts of her body. Alexis and her mother both survived the attack. Vesna Volivik Vesna was a flight attendant on a plane that was planted with an explosive device by a far-right fascist terrorist group. Once the plane was in flight, the device detonated and Vesna, along with the plane's 28 other passengers, fell for three minutes in the sky before crashing into the side of a frozen mountainside. With a fractured skull, both of her legs broken, and three broken vertebrae that left her paralyzed from the waist down. She was in a coma for three days and later underwent surgery that restored movement to her legs. 